Hi guys, welcome to this session. In this session, we're going to talk about the Facebook ads experiments. So experiments is a feature which we have in the Facebook ads platform, which helps us to test different types of ads, ad creatives, ad sets or campaigns. So we can create different ad variations and we can do A-B testing through experiments. So this really helps us to understand which are the, and we can identify winning ads with this. So we can create different versions. Maybe we change images, we make changes to the landing page, we add more videos possibly and create new versions of the ads. And now we would like to test it with the running ads, the current ads which are there in the campaign. So by using experiments, you're able to do A-B testing on ads. And then at the end of the test, you get to understand whether the new version was performing better or not. If that was the case, then the new ad gets implemented into the campaign. So let's have a look at this guys, how we can use this specific feature on the platform. So once you are in the account guys, you can go to all tools and over here specifically, we can come to experiments. So now Facebook allows you to do experiments, which are going to be for A-B testing purposes. You can do a brand lift experiment also, or a conversion lift experiment as well. So let's look at A-B testing. So in A-B testing, you can do a test on campaigns compare two different campaigns, or you can do comparison of two different ad sets. So let's say we're doing ad sets. So here you select the two different ad sets, which you want to compare in this particular manner. And then what you can do is you can schedule it for how long you want to run this test for. And if suppose a case that while the test is going on and we figure out a, re account, a specific winner, which is like 100% sure that that will be the specific winner, then we can choose to stop the test right away. We might not need to go till the end of the duration. So that option is also there. If the winning ad is, is greater than, is better than the other ad 80% greater, then we can do this as well. We can switch this option on. You can give this test a name in this particular manner. And then we can choose the metric as well, based on which we are going to decide. We want to decide which is the winning ad set. So let's say we are deciding based on cost per purchase. And then we can have a look at the test that this is what we are trying to compare Okay, review the whole thing, the test details, and we can create the test. So now this test is being created and this will start running for that particular duration, which we have set it out for. Now, at the end of the test, we will get to know the results of it. You can also view the results on the left panel when you go here. So this is where we can view the progress of the test as well, which Facebook will give us data about that how both of the ad sets are performing right now in terms of cost per purchase. And from there, we can clearly know which is the winner. And once we identify the winner, that can be implemented into the campaign. I hope this makes sense. And now you understand how we can make use of Facebook ads experiments in the account. And we can go ahead and find out winning ads, winning ad sets for the campaigns. Thank you so much guys for listening into this session today and I will see you in the next video.